Tim Miller once again talking about finding your best golf. Today I'm going to discuss un, uh, difficult lies where the ball sits down a little bit. In this case I've hit a good tee shot or even here on the practice range sometimes it wouldn't hurt to practice hitting balls out of an old divot where the ball sits down. Now the ball center of gravity is lower because it's obviously in a recess, a hole or an old divot. The mistake I see players make is they try to hit the ball too far and too hard out of this type of lie. The important thing is clean contact. Now to hit solid shots out of this lie, I try to get the players to understand that let's say we're trying to go as far as we can. We want to cover at least 150 yards or more. Well, let's say that normally would be my five rescue for 160 yards. But the lie is such, sitting in a hole, they'll try to force this shot. They'll hit the same club anyway top the ball or chunk the ball and of course only hit it a short yardage. So I say you need to give up on this club that you normally use, take a club that has more loft. In this case I've gone to a six iron and I think I could hit six iron out of this lie but let's say it was even a worse lie, well then I might go all the way down to a wedge or a nine iron. But either way you should take a club that has enough loft that we can get the ball slightly elevated out of a poor lie or tight lie. Now I'm going to take the six iron set up. I'm going to choke down first of all to the middle of the grip. Why do I do this? The shorter the golf club is, the closer I can stand to the ball. And the closer I can stand to the ball, the more up and down I can swing the club, up and down to the turf. The longer the club is, of course, it's more like a windshield wiper. I'll be going around more. We don't want that when the ball's in a tough lie. We want to be closer to it with a more vertical swing up and down so I can put pressure on the turf. So the ball's sitting down, I take this club face first, if I want to hit the ball first we're going to move the ball back in the stance just a little bit. But anytime we move the ball back in the stance we have to close the face slightly in order to keep the face square. So I'm in the middle of the grip, I take the club face from square and I close it in a little bit closed, play the ball under my right chest when I set up, now the face is a little shut, and then finally since I've choked down I'm closer to the ball. I make a more vertical swing down onto the ball. Probably the biggest key is not trying to hit the shot too hard. You want to make about a three-quarter power swing, a descending hit, hit the ball first, and to encourage that, I'm going to lean a little bit on my front leg. So the ball's back in my stance a little bit. My weight's on my left side. I'm going to swing the club up, down on the ball, and through. Hopefully that helps you find your best golf. Good luck and play well.